Okay, we're going to now work on the right side and we'll be working on PNF upper extremity diagonal two. And it looks like this, if you remember reaching up and, excuse me, diagonal one, reaching up and across, and then down and out. So we'll start with rhythmic initiation, up and across, and then I want you to turn your hand, push down and out. Good. Squeeze my hand, pull up and across. Open your hand up, good. Push down and out. Pull up and across, a little bit of traction, remember, and then open up, push down and out. Very good. Now we're going to switch to something called combination of isotonics. I'm going to have you reach up and across, and then I want you just to resist my movement slowly, back down. So it's just for D1, flex D1 flexion. Pull up and across. There's our concentric motion. Now resist it as I bring you down. Move nice and slow and controlled. Good, and there's the eccentric part of that D1 flexion pattern. Concentric, coming up, eccentric, coming down. Combination of isotonics. Okay, let's try it with uh, D2 now. So we'll do rhythmic initiation initially, so you'll reach up and out. Squeeze my hand, pull down and across. And again, up and out, and this time we'll work on the extension. Down and across. Okay, one more time up and out. So now if we're working on the combination of isotonics with D2 extension, I'll have you pull down and across. Now what I want you to do is resist this motion as I bring you back up. So she's eccentrically working the D2 extension pattern, and now concentrically pull down and across. Good. And then one more time up and out. Eccentrically working, good, and then concentrically working. Okay, and remember it's important to get yourself in that diagonal so that you protect yourself with good body mechanics as well.